Hey everyone, so yesterday it was Christmas so I wanted to show you what I got this is in no way me bragging about what I got I feel very very lucky to be surrounded by people who felt the need to give me these things and I like to watch these videos myself so I decided to make one and I hope you enjoy it. This is not just my Christmas gift, this is also what I got um, for Elvent. I don't know how to pronounce that in English, but so this is just like a mix between all that. So <laughs> the first is these. I got these for Advent. I'm gonna start with those gifts. Um, but yeah, I got these and they are so comfy. Uh, my feet are cold a lot of the times, so I'm definitely gonna use these. And then I got a beautiful, beautiful vase. I'm not gonna take it out of the packaging because we are gonna um, put this up on the loft for when me and my boyfriend move, which hopefully will be not too long. But I got this beautiful, beautiful vase and I can't wait to <laughs> open it and put some flowers in it and I'm so excited. I never expected to be excited by something like this, but yeah, I am. And then I got these um, small candle holders that matches the vase and I am super excited. There are four in it and um, they are so cute and this and the vase is made out of white glass I also got this sketchbook um, which I am starting uh, to use I already have a couple pages I'm not gonna show you too much but I have about this much uh, which is not a lot but I haven't really had the time because it's was around Christmas that I got it, you know, and we had a lot of, a lot of things to do. And then I got this. It is a non-stick muffin pan from KitchenAid. I have gotten a lot of presents from this brand. I love this brand. It's high quality and it's very good. Um, so it's a hard pan, it's not silicone, which is gonna make it so much easier to use, but especially to clean. Then I got, this is the Christmas presents. Uh, I got this uh, marker holder, which I am so excited to use. You can kind of see it here. Uh, you can just layer them as you want, and this can hold 72 markers. I have a lot more, so I'm gonna need more of these. But I like that it is individual holes for every marker and not just big holes like for every color but for each individual marker, which is what I was looking for. So I got some new markers. Um, they are alcohol based and there are 24 pieces and this is the color that I have. Um, I actually don't know if it is brush or fine nib because it doesn't say. Then I got these pigment liners and I already have them, I have used them before and I just wanted some more because you can never have too many I feel like because I use them um, in all of my drawings so yeah and I didn't, I have had the ones that I have for a while so I don't really know when they're gonna run out of ink so I wished for some new ones and I got them. And then I have this sketchbook, which is in A4. I already have one in A3, and I used to have one in A5, but I already used that up. But I did get a new A5, so... And I love these. These with um, my touch markers blend super nicely. Oh, get in there. Um, on this paper they blend and have such a good vibrant colors um, so I know it's not marker paper but the marker paper that I've tried I absolutely hate it I couldn't blend whatsoever so yeah 
then I got a KitchenAid recipe book um, which is for everyday use and for parties that's what it says on the front and it has a lot of different um, stuff <laughs> and then I got this other sketch book um, with really really thick paper so I can't wait to use this with my markers to see if uh, it's better because the because in, wait, I'm just gonna get it <laughs> and this it bleeds through and can transfer on or it does transfer onto the pages underneath so I have to put something in between so I'm really excited to see if that's gonna happen with this as well because it is so thick and I got another sketchbook I have gotten so many sketchbooks this year um, and I have never used paper from Faber-Castell before and then I got this yeah sorry uh, about the glare but I haven't opened anything yet because I wanted to show you guys before I opened it um, but I got this little holder for all my loose drawings it's just yeah you know it's a map <laughs> Uh, and I can take this piece of paper out and put my own in it, which I am looking forward to because I don't like the way this looks, but I think it's fun that I can design, uh, design it myself. And then I got another thing from KitchenAid. It, this is not sponsored whatsoever, but it's a good brand. Um, it is a small Kermit Baker. I don't know <laughs> what that means, but... It's just a small little thing you cook in. <laughs> and I got this in three sizes. I got the small one. I got the medium. And I got the big one. They are a little bit heavy, but they are really, really sturdy and good. And then I got three loaf pans, um, cooking sheet, whatever, a cake pan, <laughs> I'm just reading what it says here, um, but they have three sizes, they have a small tall one, like this one, a big tall one, and then a big low one, so the, the low one is just for cookies, and then cake and lasagna, which my boyfriend makes the best lasagna, so I can't wait for him to use it. <laughs> And then I got these two sets of Faber-Castell um, pencils. I got just gray and I got some skin tones, which I'm excited about. I have um, a Faber-Castell set of 24 um, color pencils and there are no uh, skin tones in there, so I'm excited to try them and see how it works. And then I got a gift card for H&M, which you know, you can never have too much clothes. And then <laughs> I got some cute ass nail polish. Uh, they have these cute faces on and the purple has shimmer in it and I love it. I love nail polish. I have way too much. I don't have anything on right now, um, but yeah. <laughs> It's adorable. Then I have a perfume. I, I got this perfume. Let me just take it out. I should have done that before I started to record, but I got this perfume and it has this cool, or sorry, wrong way, this cool um, thing. And that was what I got for Christmas. And oh, no, I actually also got this. Um, jogging sets from Puma, which I'm wearing, and it also came with matching pants, and it's very comfy. So, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button and subscribe because I upload every Tuesday and Thursday. And I hope you had a merry, merry Christmas and will have a happy new year. Comment down below what you got for Christmas because I really want to know. Bye. This is just how it looks. I am just gonna remove my...